Hold on, hold on, hold on. Emotional. Why are you sitting there? What do you mean? It's my spot. I'll let you have your spot back. There we go. Is that better? All right, it's good. What's up, guys? Today is a new day. We've got rid of the other girl and we've replaced her with... This girl. Okay. This is What the fuck Is This? And I'm DT. And I am Ainsley Rodriguez. Why do we have to put last names in it? I don't know, I feel like... Why, why... Okay. Should we run that again? No. And today we're going over adrenal fatigue. So first off, the adrenal glands are two things located above your kidneys. Kidneys. Yes. <laughs> Sorry. Over there. And uh, they are responsible for how your body deals with stress. So emotional, physical, all that kind of stuff. Okay. So depending on the type of stress that your body goes through, your adrenal glands respond and end up sending hormones out to kind of deal with that. So let's take pre-workouts for example. They contain stimulants, caffeine, and I don't know if you've ever gotten to the point where you just take a bunch of pre-workout, a bunch of coffee, and you just don't feel like it's working anymore, don't feel like you have any more energy. So what are you going through, DT? I'm going through nothing works at this point. So I do my one more rep, one scoop, two scoops. I kind of just stop it at two scoops. Coffee doesn't work. I have no more pick-me-ups. Um, I have a little hard of a time getting up in the morning and kind of going to sleep. So I'm a little restless throughout the night. Um, it's pretty much where I'm at. So I've eliminated everything, coffee, all caffeine from my diet and I'm just letting myself naturally detox. Yes, which is the best thing <laughs> that you can do. Having natural stuff for me is great. <laughs> <laughs> So I think we've all been through this point before and the withdrawal totally sucks. Yeah. It does. But it's something that you have to go through and instead of, when this happens to you, instead of going to three or four scoops, you should do exactly what DT is doing and just cut it out, focus more so on recovery, get enough sleep, drink a lot of water, um, and then you can actually replace your pre-workout with BCAs. And the reason for this is because when you're going through adrenal fatigue, what happens is uh, sodium actually decreases as well. So you crave salty things. So what you wanna do is replenish your electrolyte stores. You can use something like BCAs and drink that instead. So this is one way that you can combat uh, adrenal fatigue. Again, uh, make sure that you have a diet that's very nutrient rich, kind of get energy the natural way. Um, you can also replace it with ginseng. Um, mm, I know ginseng, ginseng, yeah, yeah. With the ginseng and stuff like, that's the only thing that I personally know of that actually helped. Um, it was a really long time ago, so it tastes like sh yes. It tastes pretty bad, especially the liquid ones, but they're really good, they work. So you guys can uh, do that. B vitamins, BCAs, electrolytes, ginseng, enough sleep, and kind of just how, go through. How long does it usually take like to get back to normal? I would say, um, let's say you've been on your pre-workout, I don't know, um, let's say three months is probably a good amount of time. I would cycle off for at least a month, but it's not until you kind of overcome it and until you start feeling like you don't need it anymore. So you want to give your body time to reset and so that it doesn't feel like it needs those things anymore. And then that's when you can kind of lean back into it again and then take another break and just kind of go through that cycle. Are you done? Yep. Okay. <laughs> All right guys, today is what the f is this? New girl, new show. Stay tuned for next week because she won't be here. So it doesn't really matter. So easily replaced. Give her, okay. give her a follow on Instagram. I don't know where the line's gonna be. But this is DT. This is Ainsley. And this is. What the. Can I say that on camera? <laughs> is this? And today, now you know. Today, now you know. Now you know what the f adrenal glands are located and what they do. Bye, guys. <laughs>